everyone, it's me, Teacher JJ, your math teacher. So, last week, we discussed about number bonds. So, in this video, we're going to review number bonds. And since I let you answer your exercises, we're going to answer it today. And let's see if you all got the correct answer. Are you ready? Okay, if you are ready, let's start. The first exercise says you're going to write the missing number. So the whole number is number 4. So how many strawberries do we have? We have 1, 2, 3, 4. So you're going to write 4 in the whole part, in the whole, and then let's divide 4 into 2 parts. So we have Two and two. So the answer will be two. Okay, next question. Look at the picture and then fill the missing numbers. So you're going to fill the missing numbers. The first one, we're going to count how many pink flowers do we have. So we have four pink flowers good job so you're going to write four and then how many blue flowers do we have we have one two so so we have one two there are two blue flowers so you're going to write two and then when we add four and two we get six so there are six flowers all together you understand okay now let's move on to the next activity so what numbers makes six so you're going to draw the missing dots to complete the number bond so you're going to draw a dot so first one, we're going to uh, draw six. Six dots. How many? One, two, three, four, five, and six. So you're going to write six in the full or in the blue circle. And then you're going to write, oh, let's divide six into two parts. So we have one, two, three, and four. So the remaining one we have one and two. So all together we have six. And then for the letter B, you're going to make also six number bands. So let's divide six. So we have one, two, three, and then the other one also have one, two, and three. So all together we have six. So when we divide six, we got three and three. Did you get it? Okay, so next one we have um, we're going to complete the number bands of seven. So look at the number of cubes in each part. So let's go first to the letter A. So the red cubes are 2. So we have how many blue cubes do we have? So 5. Very good. So we're going to write 5 and then we're going to add 2 plus 5 to make 7 so good job so the next one how many green cubes do we have how many green cubes do we have so 1 2 3 4 and 5 so you're going to write 5 and how many orange cubes do we have 2 so 5 plus 2 is equals to 7. So 
So 2 and 5 make 7. And then 5 and 2 make 7. So let's go to letter B. So how many purple cubes do we have? How many purple cubes do we have? So please count. 1, 2, 3. So we have cubes and how many blue cubes do we have one two three and four so we have four so we're going to add three and four is equal to seven and then the next one how many red cubes do we have one two three four so we have four red cubes and then how many green cubes do we have one two and three so we have three green cubes so four plus three is equal to seven and then you're going to write three and four make seven four and three make Seven. So, for this one, we're going to do a problem solving. So let's take a look at this picture. So, Ravi and Janice are flying their kites at the park. So, the four children join them. So, how many girls do we have now? So, let's count. One, two, three, four. Four. So there are four girls and how many boys do we have? We have two boys. So we're going to write four into the pink circle and then two into the other pink silver circle. So if we add four plus two we got six so there are how many children do we have now we have six so we're going to write six into the blue circle okay did you get it okay now let's go to the letter B so since we have six children how many types do we have so there are seven kites. Very good. So let's count them all together. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Because the other children is holding a two kites. So now we're going to write seven into the blue circle. And then we're going to divide seven into two parts so how many red do we have so we have two red kites how about how many blue kites do we have we have one two three four and five since the other boy is holding two kites so five Plus 2 is equal to 7. Now let's go to the another problem. So let's color the paths that Joey can take. So let's color the paths that Joey can take to collect 9 nuts. So we have um, Joey is the squirrel. So Joey will get or collect my nuts so look at the pictures first so each each place have different nuts or different number of nuts so how many nuts must joey collect so we uh, joey will collect nine nine nuts 
let's start from the first patch. So we have three. And then the other patch we have two, one, three, and two. If we got uh, if we add them all together, we will have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. But the problem is you're going to collect only nine nuts. So let's take a look this answer. So First, you're going to start from 3, and then you're going to collect 2, so we have 5, and then we go to the number 1, 5 plus, it, uh, five plus 1 is 6, and then plus 3, 6 plus 3, we have 1, 2, 3, 7, 8, 9, so Joey collected 9 nuts, so for the letter B, so we're going to start from 3, 1, 2, 3, and then go to 1, 2, and then 1. And then the last path that we have is 3. So all together, Joey collected 9 knots. Okay. Now, this problem, you're going to draw... You're going to draw so city has five pencils she wants to put them into two pencil for holder so uh, we're going to divide five into two pencil holder so let's take a look this one so the first way that we have you're going to put five and then divide it into two so we have one and then the other or the remaining pencils we will put it to the another holder so we have one and then four so you're going to draw it in your book so the second way that we have so five and then we're going to divide it into two again so we have two and then the remaining one we have three so three plus two is equal to five okay okay did you get it did you get all the correct answers okay good job that's all for today and then thank you for listening have a good day goodbye everyone